Are you looking to purchase solar and batteries but are not yet ready to pull the trigger? Well, I'm glad to announce that Goodwee has the perfect solution for you. The Goodwee EH 5 kilowatt hybrid ready inverter. Now, in, this, in its default mode, this behaves as a grid tie inverter. And also the associated costs are likewise. But once you are ready to pull the trigger on batteries later down the line, when the government schemes or rebates come into effect and batteries are more affordable, you simply purchase an activation code from One Stop Warehouse and input it into the PV Master app or portal. So thanks guys, stay tuned. Hello everyone, today I'm honoured to be joined with the Technical Service Manager of Goodwill Australia, Mike Zhang. How are you Mike? Yeah, good, good. Ramsey, yourself? Good. Good to have you. Now Mike is a really good friend of mine and One Sub Warehouse and he's going to walk us through the Goodwill EH Hybrid Ready Inverter in a little bit more detailed, then also follow up with the uh, steps required to activating the back battery function. Yeah, sure. Uh, Ramsey, firstly, this is a very new product in our Goodwill family and it comes with 3.6, 5 and 6 kilowatt. And this one uh, is actually a hybrid ready, as you mentioned before. And this one uh, basically has charge, discharge, and even the backup, which is 100% uh, the same like the AC rated. And it's currently compatible with BYD HVM and AVHVS. And for LG high voltage, it will be com compatible very soon. Cool. And now Mike will walk us through all the inputs from left to right. So one of the good things I like this product is the whole front uh, cover design. So instead of use the LCD screen, we use the LED light. So customers still can uh, get as many information as they can through this LED light. So from left to right, we have this system light indicate whether the inverter is working or not. We have the backup LED light just tell customer whether the customer is using backup or not. Battery have two uh, status. One is a uh, solid blue light, which means battery is charging. If it's blinking, that means battery is discharging at night. And also the grid is, is solid, which means it's connected to the grid. Energy light, just tell customer whether you sell the electricity to the grid or buying from the grid. Comms, just indicate whether your communication between equipments are good or not. And Wi-Fi, of course, indicate you whether your inverter powering the internet or not. For light, just tell you whether the inverter is healthy for working or not. And one of the unique is this uh, battery LED light. This can give you a very direct image how many electricity is still in the battery. And for this, uh, how the hardware connections will give you this uh, compliant DC isolator which is uh, compliant with AS5033 and we give two pairs of DC input for your solar connections and one uh, pair of DC input for your uh, battery connection. There are basically two different types of connectors. For the solar is MC4, so for battery is Phoenix connector. So this is basically no chance for installer use the wrong connector and we give the Wi-Fi as a standard and also as a Always, we give two pairs of uh, communication cable. One is to the inverter, uh, one is to the meter, one is to the battery. And then this one is also have the inbuilt uh, backup. So we have two terminals. One is for backup connection, the other is for the grid connection. Good day everyone. Uh, today we are going to use a smartphone to demo how to uh, commission a Goodwill Hybrid Ready EH inverter. And if you have the battery active code, this app also can allow you to active the battery function. So firstly, connect your mobile to solar Wi-Fi, which comes out from the inverter. Then open the PV Master apps select the inverter which we are going to use and give the app a few of seconds the app will sh show you the operation data collected from this particular inverter so for the new installations we always go to settings select basic setting for setup so the setting is protected by the password first page is country selection so in australia the app gives us the so all DNSP we potentially could be used on site. We just select which utility provider we used in this particular area. And once we select it, 
all the great uh, connection requests, including what wall and what wall settings, has been preloaded. Then we go to next, and apps uh, give us full working mode. As always, we just select general mode as default. Because this one is hybrid ready, so we don't need to set up the batteries. But if you have the battery active code purchased from uh, the wholesale channel, you can always just go to advanced settings and scroll down to battery function activation part, press start, and you can just uh, tap in the unique battery active code for your, for your inverter, then press start to activate the battery function then you go back to the basic settings to uh, set up the battery again